<laughs> Aloha friends! Lighting is off again, but uh, welcome back to a Simply Simple scent. I have a scentsy, warmer scent scents that I wanted to um, share with you guys today. I have a couple of scents here, and then I've already filmed. I feel like I'm crooked, like, like this. <laughs> I'm sorry! It bothers me. I have OCD issues, my friends. <laughs> I have OCD issues. I think just a tiny bit more. There we go. Okay, I'm good. Um, I've already filmed the warmers that I wanted to share with you guys and I started off into my coffee bar and then right across the coffee bar and then moved on to like the kitchen where I have my um, my farm theme but I went ahead and changed the theme into my coffee bar so enjoying spring aloha happy spring and I just wanted to let you guys know as far as like the scents and warmers videos that I will be making it's going to be a little bit limited if we start working on to our kitchen um, I am planning on refinishing my floors uh, myself and then hubby and I along with Miss Mary she's gonna help us do our cabinets kitchen cabinets but um, she <laughs> she has to work and then hubby is retiring from the military so we kind of got that going on and then plus my work schedule so we're gonna and as always take our time doing it but wanted to share that with you guys if you do not see um some videos popping up it's because it's spring over here in the pacific northwest we hibernate during the winter <laughs> it's so cold come springtime and summertime it's like gardening and then home projects okay so let me go ahead and first of all share with you guys i have my catalog so i want to take out the the area of where it has the the new like the new release because i'm trying to really enjoy the new release um before anything else so that if i need to order then i can go ahead and place an order my new scents that I'm enjoying is going to be first the the scent of the month. So the scent of the month for now March is the pink uh, strawberry mint. I just shared that onto my last video. It has it's supposed to has like um, it's supposed to have plum, raspberry, and strawberry as well as like a peppermint and then vanilla and coconut. To me, this is a creamy, fruity scent rather than a refreshing fruity it's more of a creamy milky base it still smells amazing and it's perfect scent for spring i am currently enjoying this right now into my um into my bedroom okay and then another scent of the month this is the one for the month of february i really really love this one red pear and pomegranate okay i currently have this onto i believe my kitchen I really like it. It's a nice um, fruity scent and a bit more refreshing than the the pink sugar berry mint. So I, I'm really, really enjoying this one. Okay. And then I went uh, through a bar of my Mahalo Coconut. I had just a few bars left onto this one. And Mahalo Coconut is now one of our um, best sellers. And it came back from last uh, last spring. So let me go ahead look for that mahalo coconut okay since he says paradise is only a whiff away with floral hawaiian lei and violet over fruity fresh pineapple and coconut so it has everything that i like and i do like it it's, it's one of the scents that i often use into like the bedroom the bathroom the kids room the hallway it's a very um refresh not yeah refreshing scent of a like a spa feel um it's not overpowering it's not strong it's not sweet it's not creamy it's just a nice um nice flow it's it's a very zen <laughs> that's what danica zen um scent so it just it puts you at ease it calms you so i really like it a lot okay this one and aloe is it aloe and cucumber aloe water and cucumber um they're very similar to me vanilla mint okay i'm enjoying that as well this is into my i believe my coffee bar into my pitcher warmer um i have this on because with this one vanilla mint to me it's just it's a very um vanilla minty <laughs> scent that if i'm cooking fish or if i'm cooking my veggies that has like certain um 
spices to it i open i try to open windows but not too long because it's still cold here but once i have the like the ref the scent of like um the minty um that minty vanilla mint it airs out the room kind of like opens the the door here and then the window here kind of airflow so it makes the the smell go away <laughs> i really like that i enjoy vanilla mint um uh, year round so always enjoy that one make a splash is one of our new release so make a splash is dewy melon and fresh green apple uh dive into refreshing turquoise waters so i want to say it was this one um i mean i i had it into the like the coastal was it the coastal warmer it's it's refreshing it's clean it's a clean scent it's a clean scent so dewy melon the melon is very very mild green apple mild and then water it's it's more of the water turquoise water again i would honestly put this into the spa like the spa scent because it's it's very mild um very mild it just has that hint of like the the melon and then the apple that makes it a bit more stronger to me than the mahalo coconut okay but it's still into the the spa feel the zen okay another um, new scent that i have is uh coral water so coral waters is lush nectarine blossom and is it peony i can never pronounce that peony okay peony uh bloom alongside bright clear coral waters i think this is the one that smelled like soap i don't know one of them smelled like soap i think this one smells like soap it smells like soap that you just got out of the shower kind of feeling but it's not bad but it's not it's not a favorite so this is coral waters it just smells clean clean scent like you just took a shower Okay, and there's nothing wrong with being clean and out of the shower smell so there's nothing wrong to it but to me when I smell it I smell clean clean out of the shower okay I might have to just warm this up into my bedroom rather than the living room because it was very mild to me okay last one is cocoa lime and cocoa lime is becoming to be my really really favorite 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 coconut milk and creamy vanilla get energized with a citrusy splash of fresh lime i love this i love this in the bathroom i love this downstairs i love this in the kitchen i love 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 this and i actually i'm gonna order more of this because i'm going to hoard this um cocoa lime i believe it's in my sensi club okay i love it it's it's a lime scent but not punch in your face kind of lime because sometimes you know citrusy can be like that especially lime compared to a lemon that's why i've always preferred the lemon scent so lemon to me is just more subtle of a citrus and then lime is just to me it's like a mojito um but then it's not really mine because there's no mint. but anywho lime and vanilla together makes a good combination okay so creamy vanilla coconut milk and then the fresh lime it's just it's goodness it's lime goodness it's my new favorite 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 scent um i'm gonna have to add this onto like the blueberry cheesecake the vanilla bean buttercream the um sweet plum pastry kind of scent and all those is like i have them into like the category of the bakery now i have lemon sorbet and cocoa lime into my citrusy um citrusy favorite Okay, so that's all I have as far as the, the scents. And then I'm going to add on the video that I shared with you guys or that I filmed for you guys to share onto this video of the warmers that I'm currently enjoying. And I look like I'm orange. <laughs> I look like the leprechaun and I don't have any lights. It's just my outdoor light. So very cloudy here in Pacific Northwest. So there's no sun whatsoever. So that's why it is what it is what if i turn it this way no okay now i'm crooked all right friends i'm gonna go ahead and end it here as always i thank you guys for visiting me here on a simply simple scent mahalo 
Aloha friends, good morning. So um, for my coffee bar, I went ahead and changed the, the decor for, um, for spring. I was trying to stay away from Easter itself and more for like spring so that it will last longer. And I went through my Sensi warmers and the best warmer that I saw, well actually Miss uh, my friend Miss Mary, uh, also another uh, Sensi consultant helped me was the pitcher. She said that that would be perfect in here because it would tie in along with like the tea kettle um, and such. And I do agree with her. And so this one, I have vanilla mint going on on this one uh, for the pitcher. And then the pitcher is nice. It's per um, pretty small. I wish it was just a little bit taller, but it's still as gorgeous. And it has the um, like the crackle finish the same finish as the the Lavender Love that I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys um, that came out onto this new catalog. These uh, little carrots I got from my dollar store. This is a home goods find. The rabbits are home goods finds. And then this one is a Target find. And then this one is a Trader Joe's real plant. It's called Flaming Katie and a hop hop basket the carrot patch sign i had gotten over at um hobby lobby this year so that was in one of my um hauls for home goods and tj maxx and hobby lobby a few weeks ago okay now i'm thinking of putting another warmer maybe by the rabbit if i do happen to find something that's more into the theme of uh, like of spring. And so with that theme of spring, I kind of carry it over to the sofa. Um, excuse the box, we are renovating the home. So this is a Billy bookcase from Ikea, but I do have a Scentsy package that I need to open and then share with you guys. Okay. And then um, changing up the decors in here. So I still have that uh, planter stand over there, but again, I'm still trying to see what I can put up as far as Scentsy for spring. Although over here though, I am finished with this side. So I do have the new uh, warmer for the month of March. <laughs> I'm like, for the month of March, and then also this is an older warmer, the bird cage that I've had for a few years, one of my favorites. Another Home Goods and TJ Maxx finds Mama Bird, Baby Bird, Love Birds uh, for uh, Ray Dunn collection. This is a Target tulips. I love this because it feels, um, it looks and feels so real. Like the petals are very velvety soft. That one is a Home Goods. And then this one is, um, Joanne's last fall. Okay. And then for this one, I do have the, the scent of the month, which is, uh, I think it's called pink sugar berry, if I'm not mistaken. It smells very, very sweet. So I do like it. And then this is for the February uh, scent of the month, which is the pear, um, I believe it's pear pomegranate. Okay. These are both element warmers, meaning that there's no light bulb. Okay, there's the cage, and then this is the dish. There's the heating plate. Okay. Beautiful warmer. So this one just came out. So let me go ahead and Turn it off so that you guys can see what it looks like when it's turned off. Element, this is just a two-piece. Here is the dish, the heating plate. Okay. It has a very um, matte finish. So be careful when you're um, touching this that your hands uh, doesn't have anything that can um, transfer the color. And then when I turn it on, 
hair. It has a bit of a glow to it. And the glow is all around. Okay. All right, friends. And then this one is my farmhouse collection um, into the kitchen right behind that uh, birds of a feather <laughs> warmer that I just showed you. I uh, went ahead and decorated this a little bit of Easter and then a little bit of a St. Patrick's Day. And so I have um, the Roos uh, warmer in here, the Deja Mu warmer, uh, as well as the, um, the Lavender uh, warmer, mini warmer that's new into our catalog. And then um, for this one, I do have a couple of new things in here. I switched things up a bit. I have the the lavender from Target, and this one is from Target as well. This one is from the Dollar Tree. I just stacked it up. It looks, um, God, what do you call those? It It's plastic, but I love the pastel colors of it. So I just have that stacked up. This was from World Market. And then this is my new acquired find. I got this from Goodwill. I wanted to get some books that would match the, the lavender warmer and I, I did find it. So this was like $2 a piece because they were hardcover. And then I got it because it was purple to match the, the lavender and I did not realize they were both container gardening books. Okay, so pretty. Uh, cool about that. Really happy that I was able to find that. This is a sign that I made. It was just one of those scrap um, scrap wood. And so I added our uh, state flag in there. Okay. And then this one was also World Market. I don't have this one turned on, but I have that one turned on. All right, so I'm gonna show you guys this one. This one um, has the Vino, but it's not plugged in because I only have a like a three prong plug and then I have um, the Alexa plug that helps me turn it on so I don't have to move anything around. Alexa, turn off Kitchen Sensi, which just makes it easy. But this one, because it is a mini warmer, it plugs onto the socket. Then I just turned that one on and off. Okay. Alexa, please turn on Kitchen Sensi. See, so much easier than having to move. So I have the Edge Core warmers in um, rose gold, the regular size, and then the mini. And then this is the copper. And then this is, I don't know, I, I believe Gather Together. And that one's empty. I have not added a scent onto that one because I did switch this off with the one over there, which is the pitcher. The pitcher used to be over here and then I decided to put this one here to change this up a bit and add the pitcher onto the coffee bar. Okay. And then these are still my dollar spot finds from Target. This is the Target and dollar spot Target. This one was, I believe, Michael's and then Target. And then this is a Target uh, dollar spot uh, cake pedestal that I use often to prop up my uh, my Scentsy warmers. This one I had gotten over at TJ Maxx or Home Goods. This is just a tier uh, display that I use the Scentsy for. Okay, I do share where I get them because sometimes you guys comment onto the um the comment below and asking where i got you know certain items just to make it easier this one is a uh, crate and barrel a couple years ago i don't believe they cared anymore because someone did ask about this and these are tin martha stewart uh, canisters from macy's years ago 